Miss Elizabeth Bennet. Good Lord, Miss Elizabeth, did you walk here? I did. I'm so sorry. How is my sister? She's upstairs. Thank you. My goodness, did you see her hem? I cannot boast of knowing more than half a dozen women in all my acquaintance that are truly accomplished. Nor I, to be sure. Goodness, you must comprehend a great deal in the idea. I do. And, of course, she must improve her mind by extensive reading. I'm no longer surprised at your knowing only six accomplished women. I rather want to know at your knowing any. Are you so severe on your own sex? I never saw such a woman. She would certainly be a fearsome thing to behold. You're too proud, Mr. Darcy. And would you consider pride a fault or a virtue? That I couldn't say. Because we're doing our best to find a fault in you. Maybe it's that I find it hard to forgive the follies and vices of others or their offences against me. My good opinion, once lost, is lost forever. Oh dear, I cannot tease you about that. What a shame, for I dearly love to laugh. A family trait, I think. Thank you for your stimulating company. It has been most instructive. Not at all. The pleasure is all mine. Mr. Darcy. Miss Elizabeth. 